today I'm at some random plot of land like two hours southeast of Bangkok for long tail riverboat racing. It's currently monsoon season in Thailand, which means water has returned to the rivers and canals, which also means so has long tail boat racing. And the first class of the day is the juniors. These are like seven and eight year old little Thai kids legitimately drag racing river boats. So this is a pretty cool setup. The way they have this, you see his propeller is locked in this loop right here. And this is connected to this lever. So as soon as they drop that lever, it drops the propeller into the water and then they are off to the races. Well, literally off to the races. Does anybody know what type of engines that they use on these things? Like, look, they just pull it off. To me, it looks like a single piston engine that would come off like a lawnmower or something. And then they just modify this propeller shaft. And these propellers, they hand make these propellers. Like, this is like, this takes a long time and a lot of work to make. So I'm, I'm walking to the parking lot and I see something that you guys definitely want to check out. Look at this thing, how they're transporting some of the boats here. This is actually like a homemade vehicle that you see quite often in Thailand, especially once you get out of like Bangkok and you get up into like the rural areas of Isan and they use like some type of tractor engine and it's just a completely custom chassis and they make these things into work trucks. Kids like totally shocked to see a white person. I think he's confused of what I am. Hello. Hi. Fist bump, maybe? Fist bump? Maybe a fist bump? High five? High five? There you go. Nice. Good job, kid. <laughs> Welcome to Thailand. He's like, holy crap, look at that extremely tall white guy. Total shock. <laughs> So every time I do one of these boat videos, I always get a bunch of comments about the Titanic build. And I'm going to tell you guys this. I have been given an update on the Titanic build, but over the past year, I've been given a lot of updates on the Titanic build. And I always relay those updates to you guys, and then, yeah, they're not, they're not true. One day you're gonna get a notification on your YouTube app that says Chad uploaded a video called The First Ride in the Titanic or something like that. It's in the shop. It's being worked on. I've been given updates, but I don't feel confident enough to pass those updates on to you yet. Okay guys, you can see next up, we have some boats that are gonna be a little bit quicker. From what I can tell, these are using uh, Rotex engines. Hello. <laughs> I'm really concerned about this sky. Like I said at the beginning of this video, it is monsoon season. And when you come to Thailand during that uh, April to September time, you're always concerned about the weather. I did a video. I planned to do a video last night at a diesel drag race event in Bangkok and it got rained out. So I did a live video. Were you there? If you weren't, it's probably because you don't have post notifications turned on you click on the little bell and you'll get notified when i do a live video they're very rare and i delete them as soon as they're gone so make sure that you're subscribed with post notification turned on thank you very much and uh it looks like we're about to start racing <laughs>
on the engine. I have no idea what's going on there. Okay, uh, lesson learned, don't try to get that angle unless you're okay getting soaked by canal water. I love how their trucks that they're using to transport the boats, of course, have T-37 replicas. I, I would honestly say that there's more vehicles in Thailand, more cars and trucks running around the streets of Thailand that have T-37 replicas than ones that don't. Okay, maybe that's an exaggeration, but legitimately, it has to be at least 25% of the vehicles on the road in Thailand have T-37 reps. It's just hilarious to me. What do you got? You got a Leo? Nice. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> kids get on the Leo already. Racing boats and drinking Leo. These kids are wild. Another reminder, if you enjoy unique motorsports content, please make sure that you're subscribed to this YouTube channel. I'm trying to get to 500,000 subscribers and your support would be much appreciated. Thank you and I'll see you in another YouTube video next weekend.